An Indiana University researcher recently made an interesting discovery. She found that mice who had come down with COVID experienced bone loss. Even more worrisome, the mice that were asymptomatic lost some of their bone too, up to 25%. We wanted to find out more about this study. It's tonight's For Your Health. Melissa Casina studies bone at the IU School of Medicine's Department of Orthopedic Surgery. Last summer, during the COVID lockdown, she decided to study what effect, if any, COVID might have on the bones of mice. What she found was startling. We discovered that, lo and behold, there's this dramatic loss of bone in these mice just two weeks after infection. Casina staff made these images comparing the bones before and after COVID. The deterioration's pretty plain to see in COVID-infected mice that had symptoms and infected mice that did not. It's about 25% loss of bone, and the cells that break down the bone are called osteoclasts, and they're up by more than 60%. Dr. Cassina is quick to point out that mice studies don't necessarily translate to humans. Still, she has learned that other researchers are getting similar results. I do know that there are some other investigators who are finding very similar things to what we're finding, which is great. That means that this is not just one person in one lab. Multiple people are starting to validate this finding. And of course, the next step will be searching for any loss of bones in humans. And Indiana University does have an NIH core facility with DEXA scans of people's bones where they can actually start to do some comparisons of people who might have had COVID and if they can see any bone loss associated with that. We'll be checking with Dr. Cassina, by the way, to see what she finds out.